see your puppy doing this. Sniffy, sniffy. Just came in from outside. Find somewhere to poop. Say, hey. Nope. Outside. I've been picking her up. Can't do it with the camera. Well, apparently I can. She weighs 23 pounds now. And I say, this is where you potty. Let's go. She goes out and potties. I have potty pads on the front porch in case she can't make it to the backyard. I usually have one on the front doorstep that she potties on if I can't make it in time to get at the door before she has to spill her bladder. Hey Freya, come here. Here you are, little stinker. Um, rule of thumb for potty training. Puppies can only realistically hold their bladder for every hour per month they've been alive. So Freya's what, four and a half months old? So she can only realistically try to hold her bladder for four and a half hours. That's if she tries. Sometimes she doesn't always. Hey Freya, come here. Hey, Freya. Yes, she says. What do you want? Come here. Do you want a treat? Okay, I'm down for a treat. So, something about treats. It doesn't always have to be food. It can be pets. It can be toys. It can be playtime. It can be attention. It can be love. It can be snuggles. But when you're potty training, always make sure you find the most valuable treat for your puppy and withhold that to your heart until the putty, the, the putty, I was trying to say potty and puppy at the same time, and until your putty <laughs> potties outside in their designated location, then they will begin to go outside and potty where you want because they want that treat so badly. Freya does it um, so often. She goes, oh, I just peed and she'll come inside for her treat. And she goes, oh wait, no, no, I gotta poop. And then she will go outside and poop. So she gets two treats. Oh, Freya, what'd you get on my finger? You. Puppies are so gross, but faces are so cute. So, I also need to talk about potty parties. Potty parties and potty journaling may seem extreme and stupid or both. Um, well, so, potty parties, when your puppy, or in my previous video, I called her a putty. Anyway, so you're puppy potties outside. Throw them the biggest freaking party and make it the biggest ordeal you have ever imagined in your life. Because when your dog potties outside, finally, for the first time, it is the biggest fucking deal. So, yes, I said frucking. I didn't say that other word. So it's YouTube friendly. But anyways, um, it is the biggest frucking or forking deal you can ever imagine and us that have had older dogs that just potty outside and ask us we take that for granted so potty parties essential make a huge deal but you don't want to like scream to the point to where you scare them but if it's outside if you scare them to pee a little <laughs> well maybe they peed more outside I don't know but you don't want to scare them also like I said with the treats and stuff yeah do that but the journaling, take note of when your puppy eats and how soon they potty after they eat. Every living being is different than the other. It's roughly about an hour after a poppy, a, po a poppy, 
You're not a putty anymore. You're a puppy. After a puppy potty or eats, they potty, well, food, they poop. An hour after they eat to 30 minutes. With pee, it can be like five seconds after they drink water. They need to pee at this age. Um, once they hit six months, they start to gain almost full control of their bladder. Almost. And the reason why I say almost is because, well, there, I've seen very few cases where it takes them a year to a year and a half to gain full control of their bladder and that's not their fault because they're puppy mill puppies well our puppies aren't puppy mill puppies so we don't have that worry so hang tight you got two more months two two more months for your puppies to gain full control of their bladder bladder if we're lucky and for them to only be four months old well four and a half months i think now um, and a few of us, including myself, oh, you're chewing your bed. Nope. Don't do that. I'll get to redirecting in the next couple of videos, but always, yeah, chew that, not that. Okay. I'll chew that. Maybe. I don't like that toy right now. Anyways. Yes. Any more questions about potty training that I didn't cover? I have millions of methods hit me up on facebook call me you got my number if you know me the reason why i am recapping on the journals is because i didn't i went on a tangent and didn't go on too much depth as i wanted to so journals are important when they're little oh did that dirt taste good okay anyways um, it helps you get a grasp on your puppy's system and how soon you need to take them out to potty so they have more successes than failures. So keep note of it. It can be a mental document if you're really good at remembering. Um, it can be a written document, like you can write it with a pen, you can keep note on your phone, or you can video it. Like whatever works best for you, but um, the whole point of potty is making it a success story instead of a failure story. Right, Freya? Success!